Good evening, parents, guardians, and community members. My name is Michelle Dorr, and I'm one of the vice principals at Thornley Secondary School. Tonight, you will have an opportunity to ask us questions in a live environment. You can also post questions in the chat room for us to answer as well. We're so excited to show you why Thornley is such an incredible school. I would like to start off by acknowledging that we are all treaty people and acknowledge that the York Region District School Board is located on the lands of two treaties. These treaties have been signed with the Mississaugas of the Credit First Nation and the First Nation of the Williams Treaties, who are the Mississaugas of Alderville, Curve Island, Hiawatha, Scugog Island, and the Chippewas of Busolel, Rama, and Georgina Island, who is our closest neighbor and partner in education. We thank them for sharing their land with us. To honor this agreement, we will take up our responsibility to be respectful of their traditions, knowledge, and inherent rights as sovereign nations. We will respect their relationship with these lands and recognize that our connection to this land is through the continued relationship with these First Nations, and we acknowledge our shared responsibility to respect and care for the land and waters for future generations. Good evening, my name is Leonie Patrick and along with Ms. Dorr, I am one of the Vice Principals here at Thornley Secondary School. We welcome our Grade 8 students, parents and families to this open house. Throughout this presentation, you'll have the opportunity to meet Thornley students and staff and learn about our school, its academic programs, its art programs, its athletic programs and the many clubs and committees that are offered. You may also wish to visit our school website where you will find lots of information about our school and offerings. At this time, I'd like to introduce our principal, Mr. Joe Foti, to share a welcome message to our viewers. Good evening and welcome to Thornley Secondary School. I'm Joe Foti, the very proud principal of Thornley. I would like to welcome you to our virtual Grade 8 presentation. Tonight, you will see our various programs. You will see our specialty programs, ACAM, which is a combination of art, drama, and tech. In that program, you will learn about acting, stage, staging various productions. You will learn about set design. You can learn about animation, filming, and special effects. We hope that you take the time to learn about the program and ask our teachers who will be live and online who can assist you. You will also learn about our pre-AP program, which is available in grade nine in math, science, and English. Our uh, AP coordinator, Madame Estefanos, is here also to answer your questions about the program and how you apply to get into our pre-AP program. We also are a French Immersion High School and we offer French Immersion and it is possible at Thornley in Grade 9 to take French Immersion to be in AP and also to take ACAM as well. We hope that you learn about our programs, that you see the various activities that are available to students. We have a vibrant drama, athletic, and music program, and we firmly believe that students learn as much outside of the classroom as they do in, and we hope that you will learn and benefit from these programs. We hope to see you in September. Thank you for your time and attention. Have a good evening. Hello, grade eight students and parents, welcome. My name is Myra Chow, and I'm this year's school council chair. I'm so happy you are considering Thornley. This is my first year at the school and first year in the high school system. My son is presently attending grade nine this year, and so far it's been great and he's loving it here. I hope you will find it as enjoyable too. There's so much to discover at the school. Thornley is known for their amazing staff, excellent programs, and great clubs and sports. On behalf of the school council, I welcome you to discover the school and become a part of the Thornley community. I hope to see you all next year. Welcome students and families to our Thornley Secondary School Virtual Grade 8 Open House. I'll be your virtual MC for tonight to get us started. And then we will have opportunities uh, to take some questions and answers and there will also be some breakout sessions. So what 
are the school programs at Thorn Lee. These are just a uh, small list, but some of our key programs. French Immersion, ACAM, which is our Academy of Creativity and Multimedia Arts and Technology program, Pre-Advanced Placement, also known as Pre-AP, for those students that are looking for a academically enriched experience in math, English, and science. Advanced Placement, which takes place at our grade 11 and 12 levels. And then students have an opportunity, depending on the course and depending on their preparedness, to write these AP exams, which are external exams offered by the College Board in the United States at the grade 11 and 12 level. Schism sectors. So schism is, stands for specialist high skilled major sectors. And at Thornley, we have health and wellness, arts and culture, and business. So students interested in biology, chemistry, the sciences usually join the health and wellness sector. Those interested in the arts, drama, music, fashion, etc., arts and culture, and those interested in accounting, finance, uh, entrepreneurship, marketing, will uh, opt for our business schism. So Thornley Secondary School Cares. So I've been at the school for 10 years and I can speak to that. We have our unique student success program where we have the Learning Center. We also have our special education supports through our special ed department, um, where our head of special ed, our special ed education resource teachers and our educational assistants are all part of that team to support those learners. We also have our English language learners support system um, for our ESL community, um, which includes not only our head of ESL, our ESL staff and teachers, but also our student success ESL support lead. And then there's guidance. Our guidance team is made up of student success, um, special ed, um, our counselors, our guidance secretary, um, and then it extends beyond that with respect to um, YRDSB supports um, and also external supports depending on the student's needs. We also at Thornley have program supports, the breakfast program, a peer mentors, where senior students support our junior students, especially in maybe courses like math and science. Thornley Wellness Initiative Council, also known as TWIC, which is also um, part of our caring um, culture when it comes to our social emotional supports. Athletics is also a, a large part of our community. So as you can see here, we have our fall sports listed here from boys soccer to girls basketball to swimming. We do have a swimming pool that's adjacent, basically 10 steps away from our building, from one door to the other. And we have a swim club and also a swim team. Winter sports, rock climbing, girls volleyball, junior and senior, all the way to badminton. And then our spring sports, when the weather gets a bit warmer, we have girls flag football, track and field, right to boys baseball. Please note, due to COVID-19, some sports are currently restricted. We hope though in the spring and obviously next September that uh, public health will be in a place where they have lifted all of these restrictions and then we'll be able to go back to um, what we would consider a full plate of sports and activities. Clubs and groups. There's actually too many to actually put on a slide deck. 
I remember two years ago, we had over 45 clubs and groups at Thornley Secondary School. And we know that based on the interest and the questioning this year, this fall, um, we have that same uh, level of uh, interest in all of those clubs. But for now, we do have a limited number of clubs, but we hope to expand that in the fall of 2022. But some of the clubs we have were fashion marketing clubs to our uh, DECA business club, to our international debate club, to drama club, and many more. So our current grade eights, you will be the class of 2026. So we would like to welcome you at this point, knowing that your transition to high school is just around the corner. So course selection. So there are compulsory credits. You must choose five courses that would satisfy these must take courses, but they can be at different levels depending on the student. So we have our pre-AP, which is our pre-advanced placement looking for those students looking for a more academically enriched program, academic level, open level, applied level, or any combination of the above. English, science, geography, French, and physical health and physical education are the big five on this slide. You might notice that I have not placed math here. So math is a compulsory course, but this 2021-2022 school year, we've introduced de-streamed math. So what does that mean at Thornley? Well, we still have the pre-AP math, which is unique to Thornley in YRDSB, which is, like I said, a more academically enriched math experience. Then we have de-streamed math, and then locally developed math. So math has been de-streamed, which now means the academic and applied levels are no longer offered provincially. Elective courses for grade nine students. So we do have our unique Academy of Creativity and Multimedia program, ACAM, which there is an application process. And there is visual arts, which includes drawing, painting, sketching, etc., dramatic arts music, food and nutrition, information and communication technology and business, also known as BTT, and communication technology. So the ultimate goal, fulfilling a career. So as you enter high school next September, the goal is to earn, for most of you, your Ontario Secondary School Diploma which then can lead you to multiple pathways, college, work, university, private training, international travel, education, which will then lead to multiple pathways to a career. With respect to Thornley, approximately 90% of our students apply to university when it's their grade 12 year. Um, but there are many options which would include Ontario colleges, apprenticeships, and the world of work. So for more information, we have provided three links which you will have access to. All students entering high school need to complete a high school registration form, and your grade eight teacher will help you with that. Our school's course calendar and website, which is always being updated, and the York Region District School Board Regional Course Directory, which is available online. So there are some important dates. Thursday, November 25th is the new student transfer request into secondary schools. And once we have that information, we will share that with all our grade eight community feeder schools. Wednesday, February 9th, is the secondary transfer meeting to be completed with respect to transfer applications. So we recommend you get your transfer application in before February 4th. The earlier, the better. 
Friday, February 11th, by noon, families who requested a transfer are contacted. Wednesday, February 16th, at 9 a.m. to Friday, February 25th, at 4 p.m., the portal to select courses for high school is open, and it's through My Pathway Planner. And the Grade 8 team and the Thornley Guidance Transition Team will support you through that process. For those outside of our feeder schools, please just make sure to contact Thorn Lee and we will support your registration and your course selection process individually. So the contact information, and you will have access to this, and it will be on our web page, our Thorn Lee Secondary School web page, but you can email any one of these um, staff members, and we'll start off with our principal, Mr. Joe Foti, and then Michelle Dorr and Leonie Patrick are our vice principals. That is their alpha surname base, but they are a dream team, so you can feel free to contact either of them to support your registration. Vivian Estafanos is our AP coordinator, so when you're looking to get more information, about your AP application and your pre-AP um, course selection, Madame Estafanos will be able to support you. Alana Byrne is our lead for our Academy Creativity and Multimedia. She's the coordinator and she can help you with your application for this unique program that is only offered at Thornley. Netta Pilaram is our FI French Immersion Coordinator. So if you have any questions with respect to French languages and specifically French Immersion, Netta Pilaram would be your key contact. And then there's Nizam Alkins. He's the head of guidance. So if there's anything you need to know with respect to the registration process, course selection, that is another person that you can go to and he will make sure um, that your questions are answered or he will find it in less than 24 hours, I promise. Now, with respect to more questions, because this is just the start, we are happy to take questions from 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. tonight, um, November 9th. Please use the chat feature on the right side of our live link. Once again, I hope you have... Um, uh, enriching experience this evening, which uh, kind of stirs and provides you with that kind of thought process of asking questions, jot them down, and then reach out and we will get um, an answer for you to help this transition, this uh, milestone trans transition really, of going from uh, public school to high school. Thank you again. Have a wonderful evening. On behalf of Thornley Secondary School, we want to thank you for taking the time to watch our grade eight night welcome video. At this point, we will move to our live virtual meeting to give you time to ask us questions and get to know us better. Thank you and have a good night.